What's going on gamers? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are about to go over the best hitters that you can invest in to make tons and tons of stubs. If you enjoying the content, make sure that you drop a thumbs up on the video, hit that red subscribe button, become part of the fam. Let's get right into the breakdown. If you're looking for a super, super fun and easy way to earn extra money, follow me on Underdog Fantasy and use code Fat Dollars for a deposit bonus up to a hundred bucks. All you got to do is come in here, make one dollar bets, two dollar bets, three dollar bets. It don't matter. Choose your players. Come over to the right, put the amount in. One dollar bet, you have a chance to win three dollars back. I will be giving you guys free picks. Follow me on my Twitter and I will give you a Discord link and let's have some fun. The first investment we're going to go over is 80 overall JD Martinez. This is more of a long term investment, but I'm expecting for him to get either a plus one or a plus two in the next roster update. You can get him for 660 stubs or you can use the method and get him for 500 stubs right now before his overall changes. JD Martinez is batting a 349 with five home runs and with 20 RBIs. But the key stat for JD Martinez right now is over the last seven games, he has 12 hits and four RBIs. Over the last 15 games, he has 24 hits and seven RBIs, okay? And on 519 against the Seattle Mariners, he went four for five. He scored three times. So 519, that was about five to six days ago. That should be enough for SDS to put him in the upgrade tier and he should get that plus one or plus two on his way to a diamond very very soon next hitter that can make you a ton of stubs is this 84 overall cj crime if you've been following the channel i always tell you guys you were able to make already double your stubs back if you did the initial investment right now he is over three thousand stubs already and i have a bunch of these cj crimes so at this rate he is already over the diamond quick sell. I'm expecting for him to get maybe a plus two overall, but at least a plus one. So he is in that 90% range that he has to go diamond. So if you invested in this, like I told you to, I would take, if you have 30 of them, take 10 of them, go ahead and sell them off right now. If you go right here to buy sell order and you go to sell, as long as it's over 3,000, so if you go 3330, you can see right there is 2997. So wait 24 more hours, let him get up to about 3335, and then you can sell off about five or 10 of your investments as long as you have 30 or more. And that's what you wanna do with everybody because just in case, SDS does not give the upgrade to the players who deserve it, you would not be missing out on stubs because people will shoot all the way down. That same card that is 3,300 stubs right now, if he doesn't move at all and get an upgrade, he will go all the way back down to about 2,000 stubs, meaning you are missing about 1,100 stubs on each and every one of your investments. You will have to wait another two to three weeks to get them stubs back. The next card is 84 overall tight friends. He's playing up to an 87 overall with inside edge. So you can see SDS is gonna have to bump his power right, his contact right. That would definitely put him in that 90% range also to become a diamond. Right now he's 3,145. If I can see in the next 24 hours, he goes up another 250 stubs, I will take 10 of my investments because I have about 25 of them. I will sell them off, get the guaranteed 3,000 stubs, and then I will hold the rest of them until he makes the transition to the diamond because the diamond is a 3,000 quick sell, but a lot of them go six to 700 stubs over their quick sell value. Ty France has been hitting crazy all season long he's at 329 batting average with 28 rbis six home runs and nine doubles very very consistent player another good card is 84 overall paul goldsmith 
he's at 3,651 stubs. Okay, so if you go right here to create sale order 3650, you can see he's still 200 stubs over the diamond quick sell. What I mean by that is, like I said, if you have 20 of these, take five of them, get your guaranteed stubs right now, 3,285, just in case SDS does not upgrade all the people that deserve it. Take five of these out of your 20, get your guaranteed stubs, and then the rest, once he gets upgraded, you can go ahead and sell them for more, or you can quick sell them for the 3,000 stubs. Paul Goldsmith is betting the 338 on the season with 33 RBIs, seven home runs, and 16 doubles. So that lets you know on the back of this car, his speed is probably gonna have to go up a little more. In the 50 range, his power rate is gonna have to go up about seven to eight. His contact rate is gonna have to go up. And this guy is gonna be a all around complete beast. If it's an 82, 83, or 84 overall, find out what the quick sell value is and you can put in the stub order for them and then you can get them at that value before they upgrade to the next tier. You're gonna have to wait two, three or four days but that's an easy way for you to make a stub profit let's go